So where do you see in Africa in the next 10 years? I'm going to be Afro land. <laughs> African first. African first. Africa first. Africa first. Africa first. Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to H2V Pro News. Africa first. Uh, if things are in order, tomorrow I'm leaving to Africa. If the political system can even be sincere to themselves and do the right thing, I'm moving to Africa the next day. Okay, talking about the Africa, what do you think the African leaders will do to move Africa forward? Uh, the most important thing is to, to be sincere to themselves, at least to think about the, the betterment of the population, at least do the right thing. If you are giving money to build road, build road. You know, Africans are not even greedy. What Africans want, give them the basic necessity of life road, electricity, they do the other things for themselves. If there's electricity, the barber, the, the hairdresser, will do the, 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 the way that they will do the work, they are not expecting anything. What the African citizen wants from their leader is the necessity of life, electricity, good road, ele water. That's all. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Yeah, and my other question is, what do you think the leaders can do to stop those stealing our resources? The, the problem we have is that there is a people that is dictating what will happen. We should do the right thing and try to put the right people at the right place. And all these people that all the Godfather is in and all this, this is a system that is putting Africa down. You know? So this issue of Godfather, and I want everybody to wake up so that we have to change at once, once and for all. Okay, thank you very much, sir. So where do you see in Africa in the next 10 years? I'm going to Biafra land. <laughs> I hope you put this one. Sure. I, I'm going to Biafra land. I'm going to Anambra. Yes. So uh, even safe now, I have put in the place in order where I will retire. <laughs> Finally, in Biafra land, you know, this is what I'm praying for. Uh, uh, in here, this is Austria. There's another one when you uh, drive maybe six hours or seven hours or nine hours now, you enter Italy yes. or you enter uh, uh, for five minutes, you enter Slovakia. They're speaking the same language. Let the people that have the same values you say, find themselves together and be a country and be a uh, nation. It is very, very important because you don't tell me that when you say, when you put uh, a woman uh, ask question, you kill the woman. And you want me to say, no, I want my wife to say his, his point of view. Yeah, and I don't want to cover my woman when it's summer here. I cover my woman and I, will, I move with short necker and looking at another, another woman. So I don't want it. I want my woman to, to a woman that I will marry. That you have, so I, will, I will happy to look at her, not to look at another woman and cover my woman and woman will be sweating. So let people that have the same value system find themselves together and live together and form a country or form a nation. This is very important for me. As I am now, I want you to be free. And I want, I don't want, I want you to have everything you, I want a woman to have, as my wife, to have it, so that I don't need to look around. So that is it. Thank you very much, sir. You are welcome. Please, what is your advice for people that will be watching you on this day? Uh, the only thing I'm telling you, even people coming to abroad, uh, you know, I'm living here. I have to tell you the truth. Uh, here is another system. And it's not exactly how people at home thinking it. It, it is not easy. It is not easy. You start, you start with your mentality, culture, culture, and everything. It's different things. It's not easy. So, but the only thing I'm telling you, and again, uh, women that are coming here as husband and wife and all this, is, please, the most important thing I'm telling you, there's no standard for whom to marriage. When you come, you look at your husband and they listen to your husband. There's some, some husband that doesn't do abracatabra. So you understand your husband, so you live together with your husband. Don't listen to what other person said. You find yourself and you move together and uh, you know that. So not, don't listen to another person because that person uh, you want to listen, maybe then you lie. So that is it. So. You see your husband, you see your wife, all of you sing together how you bring your, build up your family. 
So that is it. Ah, thank you so very you much. You are welcome. Sir,